relations between different countries. Yes. Nakakalimot na merong ganito, pero merong ray of hope dahil maraming mga grupo na nagpro-promote rin ng peace. At ngayong umaga, malalaman natin more about this dahil kasama natin si Bay Rohanisa Sumdad Usman, ang country director ng Asia America Initiative Philippines. Yes, good morning. Good morning. Po. Hi, good morning. Yes, maybe we could start off by explaining what Asia America Initiative Philippines uh, is and what what your group does. Uh, okay. Um, Asia America Initiative is actually a non-profit organization. We have been doing peace and development work in the Philippines. Um, ang aming ginagawa dito sa Pilipinas ay we build a culture of peace, one child, one school, and uh, one community at a time. Okay. How yes. long have you? How long has the NGO been up? Um, it's our tenth year. Okay. Yes. And uh, we have uh, conducted a lot of innovative and creative programs um, in terms of uh, how to support the peace building process. Yes, maybe we could talk about we could talk more about the programs that you've done already in the past and like uh, how it relates to the goals of uh, your group. Um, since I mentioned a while ago, um, our goal is to build a culture of peace, one school, one child, and one community at a time. We have conducted uh, peace building programs like. Yung Oling Peace, Building a Culture of Peace Through Sports, wherein uh, we integrated yung peace values, um, like values that can contribute to peace and development in the country. Uh, sinisimula namin ito sa mga bata, as young as six years old, because we believe that uh, napaka-importante ng formative years of a child in terms of uh, um, setting a positive mindset na that they should be a part of the peace building process. And we also had uh, mga peace workshops um, and this coming May 26, we'll be having this Building a Culture of Peace through Arts also. And um, we also have been uh, supporting the peace education, which is uh, implemented by different schools. Because um, one of the kakulangan natin in Philippines is how can we develop materials that can teach both the children and youth yes. on how they can uh, take part, yes, take part in, in terms yes. of the peace process. It's nice na you will start from children kasi yes. grow up parang open-minded yes. na sila and, and wala na sila. Still na rin sa mind yeah. nila na they have to do their part and uh, sila nga ay part ng peace process. Yes, of yes. course. But in what other countries are you active? Um, we're also active in uh, Afghanistan, Cambodia, uh, and Vietnam. Mm -hmm. How about the group naman po? How about the members? How many members does the Asia America Initiative have? And like if there are uh, interested people who want to be part also, how can they become a member? Yeah, we have a lot of volunteers um, from all over the country. Because uh, it is important uh, in the kind of work that we do. Um, yeah, we, we call our volunteers Catalysts for Peace. Uh, we are around 1,000 plus already all over the country. And for those who are interested to participate in our programs, they can just check our Facebook page. It's Asia America Initiative Philippines, or they can also contact us at 4037910. Okay. And lahat, it's, it's our organization is open to all. Um, we want to promote solidarity between different cultures, religions, and ethnic groups. So kahit saan ka manggaling, so we really want um, every Filipino to work together for peace. Okay, and you mentioned earlier that you will be having an event. The arts, um, are, you're going to promote peace through arts. Can you tell us a bit more about this? Yeah, okay. Um, ang title ng project is Lakbay Para Sa Kapayapaan Sa EDSA. It's actually a joint collaboration between Asia America Initiative, Philippines, Armed Forces of the Philippines, Office of the Presidential Advisor on the Peace Process, Dolphins Love Freedom Movement, Metro Manila Development Authority, and nakakatuwa rin po kasi meron tayong mga corporations who also joined in this activity. So, Pinapakit talaga ng proyekto na ito yung the bayanihan spirit, yes. yung kultura Even natin. Even yung private yan. sector, kumbaga, they're taking yes, part in Yes, private sector, the yeah. You, so we call them business partners for yes. peace. Uh, ito po yung uh, Davis Paint Philippines, Universal, Manila Water, Bayani Brew, Enchanted Water. And we also have a government agency, which is your Autonomous Region in Muslim Mindanao, Bell de Jour, and I Volunteer Philippines. So ang dami yan. Um, in seven days pa lang that we promoted this uh, project, we already had 1,000 um, persons who registered to participate and express their support in this project. And the good thing is, um, itong Lakbay Para Sa Kapayapaan Sa EDSA, it's the making of the longest peace mural in the world. 
okay? Yes. Ang ganda kasi dito, Carla, parang siguro it comes to a surprise to people na parang marami pala ang nagtitake part na gumawa ng ano sa peace. Kasi siguro may mga iba na medyo naive, hindi nila alam kung paano sila makakatulong. And ito na nga siguro yung perfect time and yung perfect chance for them to take part. Now, aside from the mural, what are the other uh, events that uh, will be... Will, will be happening during this uh, event. Uh, okay. Um, yung just to give everyone a background on what's going to happen dito sa project na ito, um, we will be painting the walls of uh, along EDSA and then Bonnie Serrano and then uh, yung Corinthians. So what will happen is we have three central themes. The first theme would be applying the Bayanihan spirit. I think um, Filipinos should be reminded na meron tayong kulturang ganito na yes. kahit sino ka man, kahit saan ka nang galing, we have this culture of bayanihan mm -hmm. that can really help contribute to peace and development in the country. And the other theme is call for peace. So katulad nga lang sinabi mo kanina, um, we want to create more awareness about how everyone can, how every Filipino can contribute to the peace building process. Kasi di ba, lagi natin naiisip pag peace, it's, it's just, it's the absence of war. It, it, peace is not just the absence of war, but it is a way of life. Yes, so, yun yung gusto natin ipahiwatig sa to every Filipino. Yes. Okay, and this event will be open to everyone. Anyone yes, can this take event, part. Yes, um, pwedeng pumunta na lang doon on May 26. We'll be starting around uh, 7 in the morning and we'll be painting the whole day until 6 in the evening. Um, the assembly area will be in um, People Power Monument. Okay, oh, yeah. I, you know what? I think it's a beautiful initiative. Because, mm -hmm. you know, like when people think about peace, it's like we feel so small because we don't know in what way we yes. can impact. We have an idea na talaga, we have to do something grand to be able to promote peace. But actually, in simple ways, such as the events that they provide and allow us to join, then we can do our own small way. Uh, that's our own small way yes. of helping promote peace yes. in our country. Maybe, ma'am, lastly, maybe you could invite our uh, viewers this morning to take part in a. Uh, join you in, in this event. Okay. Um, to our dearest brothers and sisters, uh, we would like to invite everyone to our upcoming project. It's Lakbay Para Sakpayapaan sa EDSA. Uh, we are encouraging every Filipino to take part in the peace building process sa pamamagitan ng proyektong ito. Thank you. Okay. Okay. Thank, Thank you, you so much. Thank you so much. Thank you for your so time much. this morning. Once again, Bye. that was by Rohanisa Sumdad Osman, ang country director ng Asia America Initiative Philippines.